Welcome to the 2010 season preview for women's volleyball. Today we're here with the head coach of the Pioneers, Rob Machen. And coach, this is your fourth year here at Sacred Heart. And every year that you've been here, the team has gotten better. Last year you finished with 22 wins and a trip to the Northeast Conference Championship game. And that being said, what are your expectations for this season? Um, honestly, our expectations every year are the same. We're trying to develop the athletes that we have and put together the best team on the floor that we can and then continually improve that as the year goes on. And whatever happens in the result of the NEC or in conference or non-conference play is sort of a result of the work we're putting in to achieve that goal. Well, you've definitely been moving up and it's caught the attention of a lot of people. This season you were ranked second in the preseason poll. Um, it's the highest the program has ever been ranked in the preseason. Does this change how the team's going to approach the season as a whole or individual matches? Is there any extra pressure or anything that you need to address because of that ranking? No, I don't think so. I we were ranked, I think, fifth the year before, sixth the year before that, and it didn't affect how we approach our practices, what we're trying to accomplish. You know, like I said before, um, our goal is to put the best team on the floor we can with the athletes that we have. And we can't really control how good the other teams in the conference are. Um, what we control is how good we're going to be, and if that is good enough to win the conference, that's great. If not, nothing we can do about it. We're going to keep working hard as we can to get as good as we can. And last question for you is, how is this team here in 2010 different from your previous three teams here at Sacred Heart? Well, I've been very blessed to have wonderful athletes come through this program, and I've been very pleased with all the teams that I've had. Um, I think the uniqueness of this team is they've been in the program now for three years. They understand the expectations that we have and, and the high level of work ethic that we have. And uh, we have excellent leadership with our captains and Courtney and Jessica and Miley. Believe that this year's team will get closer to finding that that goal of reaching our potential, and hopefully, we'll that'll be enough to get the job done when we get done. Well, good luck this season, head coach of the women's volleyball team, Rob Machen. Thank you. Thank you. We're now here with Courtney Kid Cadillac. She's a senior captain of the Pioneers. And Courtney, this is your third year as a captain. And how does that change your role on the team? As a captain, we set the guidelines, expectations of the team. Coach doesn't really give us any rules, so it's it's our duty to create them and make sure the girls maintain a good respect to the program. Uh, last year, you were the Northeast Conference Setter of the Year, you know, first team All Northeast Conference selection. Do you ever think about that? Does that add any pressure at all? Uh, no pressure at all. I play every game the same, every point the same. It doesn't matter what awards you get. And when we get awards as a team, it's not about me. It's about everyone. So, no pressure at all. Okay. Well, this is your senior season, your, your last collegiate volleyball season. Everything goes perfectly. What would you like to be the end to your career? Honestly, I just want a really good competitive season. Obviously, a nice banner and ring would be a good ending. And uh, to play well in the NCAAs first round, that'd be great. And Courtney Kid Cadillac of the women's volleyball team. They start their season August 27th as they head to the West Coast for the Long Beach State Tournament. Thank you, Courtney. Thank you.